Hey guys, welcome back to Feel the Burn. Welcome back, Burners. Could be taking on the other three of LU Koteco this week. Uh, make sure you like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Make sure you're following us on Instagram, Mirabella underscore TV. Mirabella underscore TV. And uh, buy our merch and become a member of Mirabella TV. When I get back, I'm going to get into the Masakera Red, Masakera Black, Habanero, and Ghost. The final three of the lineup. Be right back, guys. All right, guys. Let's read the ingredients. I'm Masakera, Marisquera Red. Sorry. A lot of ingredients. Wow. Water, habanero peppers, dried chili, salt, acetic acid, lemon juice, xanthan gum, gelatin gum, sodium benzoate, oh, that's it. I thought it had more ingredients. There's a lot of writing down there. All right, well, we'll give it a smell. How about that? We'll go from there. Come on. What in the It tricked me. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> no. I'll worry about the rest of that later. Get that lid off. That smells good, guys. Smells really good. This one's got a different kind of lid on it and everything. Let me see if I can get this off. I want to show you guys the cool lid. These beans are stinking stubborn. There we go. Usually I can get them off a lot easier than that. It's got one of these flip top lids underneath. Now, on this one, the Marisquera Red, 1,398 Scoville. I'll pour it from this. Usually I don't like these flow restrictors. All right, get a good spoon. Let me smell it one more time. It smells really good. Cheers, guys. Let's get ready to feel the burn. Here goes. Flavor pack. Salty. Mmm. Take a heat, hit me now. So a very very well blended Mexican hot sauce. Says this is for seafood, and I could definitely see that. Seafood habanero hot sauce. I can see it. We'll on to the next one. We'll be right back, guys. All right, Marisquera Black coming right up. Let me read these ingredients. Water, habanero peppers, tomato paste, hydrolyzed soy protein, salt, acetic acid, citric acid, xanthan gum, spices, and sodium benzoate. This one contains soy. It's a little different. Get right into this. I can get it off a little easier. Try to cut myself on video. Be some pretty messed up content. Uh, here we go. Got that strip there. This one almost uh, smells uh, smoked, smoked like a chipotle almost. It's real interesting. Maybe the soy is what's doing that. Yeah, I am actually catching a little bit of that. Well, we're about to taste 
see the difference here. Pour some of that on here. Okay. 2,046 Scoville units. Cheers, guys. Let's get ready to fuel the burn. Here goes. Oh, man. Salty in the most incredible possible way. Both of these, but this one. Mmm. So salty, so flavorful. This one's special, guys. Oh, that's great burn, too. Oh, man. That one's good. I'll be right back with the habanero and ghost. We're going to see how hot they go. Just a minute. All right, guys. Moment of truth is here. Water, habanero peppers, tomato paste. Sugar cane, salt, xanthan gum. Natural ghost chili extract, spice, paprika, acetic acid, lemon juice, chelan gum, natural flavoring, caramelized onion, and sodium benzoate. Let's break this thing open and we will take a good smell and then get a good spoon poured and ride the wave. I love ghost peppers guys, so. That smells amazing. Amazing. Citrus. A little vinegar smell, a little saltiness. The, the flavor on this is gonna be over the top. I know it is. Thick. Oh, that's a full spoon, guys. I'm gonna ride the wave. 14,165 Scoville units. Pure ghost power. That smells so good. Cheers, guys. Let's get ready to feel the burn. Here it goes. Mm hmm. Flavor bomb. Mmm. Comes the heat. That's real heat. For a store bought, that's real heat. Woo! Oh! That lit me up. Ghost. That lit me up. So delicious. I am roasting. So good. Drooling. All right, guys. I'll be back. I'm going to compose myself. And I'll give you the ratings on these. Be back in a minute. Hi guys, I am back with the ratings on these. So in the order that I tried them, Marasquera Red, delicious saltiness on this. Um, flavor is incredible. I, I can't even describe it. I've never tasted anything quite like it and it was so good. I'm going to say heat on this, amped it up a little bit. Uh, nothing above a three. Uh, and that three faded pretty quick. Uh, flavor, 
I'm gonna say flavor on this is a nine, a hard nine. Delicious. Overall on this one, I wanna give this one a, a, a well-earned nine and a half overall. Really good. I'm still lit up, guys. Maris Guerra Black. Now this one, it ramps it up just a little touch more. Uh, I want to call this a three and a half. Pretty warm in the best possible way. Uh, flavor on this one, it is so good. It is a 10. Nothing I have ever tried quite like it. So enjoyable with that soy added to it. And I can definitely see how it would go great with seafood. Overall, this one is a 10. It's incredible. Pick yourself up a bottle. Now, the one that was uh, the most punchy one, Habanero and Ghost. Now this is one of the most flavorful ghost pepper sauces that I've had in a long time. Smells amazing, tastes amazing. It has this good, I guess uh, it's kind of what I grew up with. It's almost like a powderiness uh, and spiciness and saltiness to it that is so appealing to me to put on Mexican food. Delicious. And the ghost pepper, I I'm not even gonna lie right now. It, it, it made me cramp a little bit. Uh, heat on this went up to, this is six and a half. It was hot, guys. I uh, had to drink some oat milk. I'm totally fine now. Didn't go into panic mode. A little bit of endorphins going on. It got hot, man. Still burning. Legitimate ghost heat. Legitimate habanero heat on this one. Over the top flavor, okay? Uh, flavor on this for, I wouldn't even call this a super hot, for a real hot sauce though. Uh, the flavor on this is a nine and a half. So good. I don't even know what I, I don't even know what I would change about it. Making it a little more, no, I don't, I wouldn't change anything. I, I can't give it a nine and a half. I'm gonna give this one a 10 also. It, it is so good. And I'm gonna give this a 10 overall. You guys have got to try this. If you're a chili head, uh, it has some real heat and the flavor is out of control. Two tens and I'd say like a nine and a half on this one. And that's only because I liked the black so much more than the red. Well guys, thanks for joining us. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Make sure you're following us on Instagram, Mirabella underscore TV. Become a member of Mirabella TV and check out our merch. And you know what? Burn out.